I looked to art history, specifically um, the painters of American tonalism and uh, the French Barbizon school. And I looked to those artists because it's one of the first times in art history you see genres of painting that dignify and celebrate the lower classes that use compositional design elements that formerly had been reserved for kings. And so I, I started thinking of this figure as, as being both a specific woman, but also an embodiment of the dignity of black women um, in general. When people look at this painting, I don't want them to, um, to just see her. You know, as I'm working on this, um, I keep thinking of my aunts, I keep thinking of my cousins, I keep thinking of, uh, you know, the black women who raised me, uh, who went to school with me. It is her, but it is her as a kind of transcendental embodiment of the strength of black women. What I love about this act, and what I love about the fact that it's being done with the cooperation of these uh, institutions, is that it feels like it's breaking down that barrier, that she is just as much a part of um, the fabric of America as Stonewall Jackson, or Robert E. Lee, or Jefferson Davis. It is saying that the history of these black people who have been in this country since the beginning, that's your history too.